Okay, so shout out to Fun Mart Bait Shop. Let's see, in Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. Holly, uh, she emailed me. Uh, she found my floats on eBay. And in, in this sort of Texas, Oklahoma, I guess, Kansas City sort of corridor, a lot of catfishermen out there fish with floats, catfish floats. You've seen me make these and talk about these all the time. We have a real like bait shop who's carrying these floats and so uh, she's had other people who make floats in her area and they say that they've never seen anything like it. You know, probably underpriced for the work you put into them. If, you know, if I had to charge per hour what the work I put into these floats, I'd probably have to charge like $18 per float or something. I mean, there's just no way, right? Because I want people to be able to buy these at a price point where if they buy, say, a dozen of them and they lose a couple of them, they haven't felt like they had to sell an arm and three legs, right, to, to use them. I'll say you can't find anything at Bass Pro Academy. I've, I, I've been those places too. You just don't see that kind of custom handmade products. But back to her shop, they carry live goldfish, bluegill, uh, which I never, live bluegill, you can buy it at a shop? I, I've never seen that. I mean, all they sell around here is just minnows, right? Uh, large and medium shiners, uh, Canadian night crawlers, Belgium red worms, and we make our own glow worms, which, I mean, that's like Chernobyl, I guess. I mean, I, but glow worms, I mean, I don't even know what you put in it, right? Cut shad, whole shad, skipjack, shrimp livers. I make my own line of bait, too. I guess that may be cheese bait, because that's really popular out there. As they say they were big back in the 80s and 70s, and they're trying to uh, bring it back. You know, I've seen that myself, bait shops around here that have just gone out of business in recent uh, years and that were great bait shops. You know, I do believe in local, I believe in business anyway. I am a capitalist, if you will. I believe in importing things, as well. but the reason you go to other places like overseas is because they can do things that you can't. That's the whole meaning of commerce. Like, you know, I'm just here in backwoods Alabama and yet she's out in Oklahoma City, right? So she has something that I don't have, which is a large population, local population of people at hand that, who, who like this kind of product. There's people using very light, very finesse types of techniques for catching catfish. They're very effective. And uh, these floats are, are part of that equation. So Fun Mart Bait Shop in Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. For those of you who are in that area, go check them out. They're on Facebook and go check them out. I think she said it's the one with the neon sign. So Fun Mart Bait Shop, Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, the one with the neon sign on the Facebook. So, but but anyway, that's them. That's a quick plug for them. I'm like serious. I'm like, go to the Facebook page and if you're on Facebook and go to their channel, go to their page and like and let her know that, hey, you heard about me on the Black Warlords channel. And see, that, that gives her recognition and that know that, hey, this is a, a viable medium. And so, um, and uh, if you're in that area, go check out her shop, buy one of the floats, catch a bunch of fish, give her some pictures. <laughs> Maybe she can hang them on the wall or something and, um, and uh, that'll build up uh, her company. Thanks, Holly. Thanks, all you guys who are always listening. Uh, I really do enjoy doing this. <laughs> so... I'll see you later.